Everyone runs faster with a knife. <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, and I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Pokemon Clover. We beat down the little bro. We should be done with the Karma sub-basement, I think. Oh, no we're not. Little brother's running through that uh, floor on the, or the door on the first floor, so we're gonna have to go chase him down, I suppose. I don't know if I'm ready, though. I've got, yeah, mostly fainted Pokemon. So I should probably uh, go heal those up before we go chase them down. Which means another little trip through the sewers, but I guess that's going to be fine. I'm already plenty stinky from trekking through the sewers the two or three times that we did before. Whatever. It be what it be. Um, maybe a repel will make it a little faster. Maybe the time that it takes me to find the repel, I could have already been through the sewers. But okay. It, it be what it be. <laughs> We're gonna make it do what it do. You know what I'm saying. And, yeah, let's just head back to Animango. I should be able to hit the Pokemon Center up right quick. And, uh, get back on the road. Eventually. No problem. This is not the way to the Pokemon Center, is it? <laughs> I'm so lost. The city's so big. I'll be glad when we're finally uh, done with this place, which I think we almost are. This is just like uh, Saffron City in that you just have to spend a whole lot of time here. It, you actually spend a lot more time here than you do in Saffron City in the original Pokemons, Fire Red and whatnot. But yeah, that's okay. We gotta make it happen. I just wanna play through the Pokemon Clover. And from what I understand, uh, Pokemon Clover is incomplete at the moment, so we won't end up being able to fight the Elite Four, which was something that I didn't realize when I started it up, but that's going to be just fine. I'll, I'll keep it on hiatus um, until we're ready to fight the Elite Four, and I'll have my big awesome team all ready to go. So let's see what we got down here in Basement 2... Uh, basement 2B, I guess I'll call it. <laughs> B2FB. Yeah, whatever. Oh, I got a Rocky Helmet. Sweet. We can put that on somebody who's uh, a bit bulky. And Dunky P. Hi, nice to see you. Nobody else is in here. Damn. Okay, so we're done. We are done. Little Brother has fled. Um, but that's just fine. I think we're supposed to go south of... What you call it? Parax Town? Where's that? Here it is. So now the fishermen should be gone from the south, and uh, we can see what adventures await us down that way. Oh yes! Spooky, scary skeletons. Just the first few notes of the song, and I'm like, hey! Hey! Hey there, hi there! Don't use another repel. I want to see if there's some cool Pokemons on this route or what. There's some dudes to, to battle. I just kind of passed over that dude. I was like, I'm not looking for a fight. Well, the fight's looking for you, sucker. Um, yeah, I don't really want to stuff Owl. Let's see, let's see what's going on with this guy. Hey, friend. Hi there. I love lifters. Their bodies are ripped. Whoa, he's like, gay bear. Gay bear Barry. Yeah, totally. Verifact Bruno. All right, nice to see ya. He's probably got a bunch a bunch of onyxes, a team of six onyxes slapping against his face. <laughs> Dick ball ignoring orders still. Use payback, so I guess that's good. I was trying to get him to use confuse ray, but that didn't work out. All right. Corn leech actually does a lot of damage for not being very effective. That is some scary shit. Let us get Phil in here because I know Phil will obey my orders, cause he a good boy. He's been with us for a long time. And if uh, Dick Ball keeps disobeying orders, I probably will just end up replacing him, which I think I've said before. This thing is grass, if I remember right, so I'm gonna use the Ice Punch. Good old Ice Punch, right in the face. Look at that. Down in one hit. Holy crap. Maybe it's four times super effective, but I don't know what the other type of that thing is. Doesn't really matter, does it? Krista King, um, Steel type, maybe? Let's try the Drain Punch. Oh, Ice. Yes, he's got that Icicle Spear. That's going to be super effective, so I hope it doesn't hit too many times. Oh boy! Oh boy! No, not five! Come on! Oh lord, that was a close one. 
please drain punch all of that back. That would be really, really nice. Yeah, Phil is kind of a, a slow mon, you know? I would like for him to be a little faster. Oh, and this thing also has rough skin. Damn. We are hurting for certain. I could sacrifice Dickball. Um, probably Mysterio is the one I want to go with. He doesn't have much in the way of defense, though, so... We might get taken down. Oh, no. He's got Pin Missile, so that's not going to be very effective because Mysterio is part Ghost. So that's really nice. I didn't know... Uh, I don't know why bugs are weak against ghosts. That doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. As far as I know, bugs don't pay any fucking attention to ghosts. A ghost is like, boo, and bugs are like, yeah, whatever, dude. Whatever, dude, I'm just operating on pheromones. <laughs> I don't even know what you're talking about. Alright, level up for Mr. Mysterio. And you can see there, when the stats popped up, his defense is poor. Special attack, special defense, that's alright. Hulkan. Oh, it's Hulk Hogan. Let the stats will gleam him. I'm sure it's fighting type. Basically, uh, yeah. 90 to 100 percent sure it's fighting type. He hits me with the fire punch. That's gonna hurt, but we're gonna take this thing down. Yeah, that weak defense is really a problem. Oh no, we're not gonna take it down. Holy shit. Luckily, he used thunder punch, which is going to be weak. Uh, because, yeah, we've got Ghost and Electric out. But yeah, that was that was interesting on his part. He could have just KO'd me there. But I'm glad that he didn't. Discharge, is it super effective? Not really. Ah, I, I don't know the types of anything. Alright, nice to meet you, bro. I was ripped apart. In my ass. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. I know what you're talking about. I just don't want to tell the kids. Kids don't need to think about those things yet. Let's Hyper Potion. Uh, definitely Mysterio needs a Hyper Potion. And Phil. We'll get him filled up with potions. Ah, ah, ah. That's a good one. I'm gonna write that down on my hands and immediately wash it. Alright, we're good. I could give somebody the, uh, the Rocky Helmet as well, but I won't. I think Bear Effect Bruno would like the Rocky Helmet, you know what I'm saying? The uh, dick helmet kind of thing. We found a chesto berry. That's nice. Ward off that sleep. Sleepy sleep. Hey, what up, dude? Prepare yourself. You're gonna fly now to the Pokemon Center. Well, maybe. Probably not, though. I, I just heal my Pokemons up. Lifter Rocky. Rocky, I must break you. Anacon Duke. Uh, this has a grass typing, if I remember right. Let's try fly. Dickball won't obey. Of course not. Of course he won't. Why would he? You know, I'm just the one who uh, traded for him and tried to level him up and all this stuff. Oh, there he obeyed. My passive aggressiveness worked on him. <laughs> there you go. Good boy. Maybe we'll actually uh, KO something. Wow, we did. I think it's grass and fighting. Like hit Monana. Look at that boosted experience. Ooh, boy. You just stick with me. Acrobatics? Ooh, that's a physical move. Yeah, I definitely want that. I guess I could replace Fly. Or Lovely Kiss. Hmm. How often am I going to use Lovely Kiss? Honestly, how often am I going to use Fly? Acrobatics is only really good if you uh, don't have a hell item. Then it's 110 attack power versus Fly's 95. But obviously, you want to keep fly because fucking you can you can fly places. Ah, oh, god. Well, HM moves are forgettable, so I'm gonna forget fly for now. Maybe I'll change my mind on that later. But yeah, we'll stick with acrobatics for just a second, since it's not a two-turn move. Which two-turn move really doesn't matter either. Oh, he's got a Batarex. Oh, Philly. Um, yeah, let's try the acrobatics. Ignored orders. Great. Use Confuse Ray? That's better than nothing, I guess. So, I'm pretty scared of this thing. I know it's got like a shit ton of elemental punches. It might cause a little bit of trouble for me, but uh, I'm going to do the best that I can against it. Brick Break? That's not going to be very effective, but I still die to it. Awesome. Super. Oh, it's neutral because it's dark and flying. Dang. Well, that's fine. Let's, um, let's get Decker out there. 
He's got that... Oh no, he's got Brick Break. What the fuck am I doing? Oh god. Well, hopefully he'll use Brick Break again, and uh, I'll switch into Mysterio and avoid it completely. Right? Right. Mysterio has that uh, fairy-type move. Haha. -ha. Can't hit me with Brick Break. Ah, ah, ah. Let's go ahead and do the Dazzle Gleam. Oh, he sucker punched me. Luckily, I'm able to live through it, but yeah. That is naughty. Naughty, naughty. It's gonna go down to that, though. Dang. He is a dangerous man, I'll tell you that much right now. Decker grew. I'm, I guess I'm glad I sent him out for just a minute, yeah? He's trying to learn Iron Head, which is the same type attack bonus move. Uh, I guess we'll forget Meme. That's fine. That's a special type attack, which, honestly, yeah. Decker doesn't have any, any special stats, particularly. So we good. I forgot to focus, and now I have a black eye of the tiger. Huh. Rocky. Yeah, that's a reference. Life isn't about how hard you can hit, it's about how many training montages you can endure. <laughs> All of them. Count on me, bro. So, let's see. Dick Balls fainted. I guess it doesn't really matter. He, he doesn't obey orders anyways. Probably just wonder trade him away. We're like, hey, we had a good time together, but it's time for you to get the fuck out of here. Goodbye! I'm so glad to be on a new route. Look at that. Ponchito. I know that's a ground, ground type. Mm, and it has Sandstream, so I don't think I'm going to catch it. Just because Sandstream is a pain in the ass, especially if none of my Pokemon have leftovers. I wonder where you find leftovers in this game. Greetings, Battle Brothers, I am new, holds up Bolter. My name is Sergeant Arcus, but you can call me Battle Brother. As you can see, I am very loyal to the Emperor. That is why I've come to meet other Battle Brothers who are loyal to the Emperor like myself. I am 127 years of age, praise the Emperor. I like to purge heretics and Xeno scum with my Battle Brothers. I love my Battle Brothers. If you do not like that, then deal with it. It is our favorite activity because they are not loyal to the Emperor. All of my Battle Brothers are loyal to the Emperor too, of course, but I want to be more loyal servants of the Emperor. Like the Emperor once said, the more the merrier. I hope to bond with a large amount of loyal servants of the Emperor, so join me in the praise of the Emperor. Farewell, praise the Emperor, Battle Brother. What? What just happened? <laughs> Who are you and why am I listening to this? Alright, whatever. Trainer tips. For added effect, use HM1 Cut while playing Lincoln Park on your Zune. <laughs> oh my god. I love that. Ah, oh, on a Zune. Yeah, totally. I'll get right on that, bro. Uh, let's try out this Iron Head on Alameo. And maybe I'll catch him if he lives. Yeah, look at that. He's strong. He's a strong boy. He wants to come with us. And I really do want to alien. I've got a lot of dark type pokes, so maybe it would be good to have a, uh, what you call them? Uh, psychic type. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Let's use these Pokeballs. Since, Jesus. When am I ever gonna need these again, right? Am I right? Come on. Oh, it was so close. Come on, bruh. Let's gonna use Magic Relief. That's okay. Because I'm not just a rock type, I'm also a steel type. So it hits neutrally. Which seems to be happening a lot in this game. They they did something with the typings. I don't know if that was on purpose. Hey, Larry Mail. I caught him. He's an alien. Maybe just call him E.T. That's uh, kind of a lame name, but why not? Larry Mail is always making some sort of laughing noise, even during its sleep. It, in groups, they introduce with an A. Hey, a. Hey, what up, dog? I like Reese's Pieces and shit. Yeah. Yeah. This E T et. That's the past tense of eight, right? Isn't eight a past tense too? I don't know what's happening. I know grandma wizard or whatever. Uh here's a bridge. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going, but we're going somewhere. Maybe if I beat you I'll stop fishing up boots. Is litter a problem in this universe? That's not good. Hey guys, hey, that's not good. Praystish. Oh my. It looks so badass. It's got like a happy face, but then it's got creepy eyes on the side. I am a little intimidated by it. Yes, indeed. Let's try and rock blast it. See what happens. 
I guess it's just a water type, which means it's going to hit me super effectively. And I only hit it twice. That's not good. It uses agility, so yeah, now it's going to be faster than me. That's fine. Let's switch into Douglas. I can get some, uh, some horn leech going. That's what I'm talking about. Uses agility again? Bro, you're already double speed. Is your speed that low that you have to use agility that many times in a row? That's a mistake. I'll tell you that right now. After one agility, basically any Pokemon is going to outspeed any other. Like, uh, Ry... was that? Rhydon? Rhyperior? Yeah. He's got, like, such a low speed, but he uses Rock Polish once, which gives the same boost as agility. Ah, oh, too bad. And then he outspeeds basically, uh, everything except super speed demons, but yeah. It's a really, a really good move to use for, on sweepers if you have a turn to set it up. My family may be starving, but at least they have fashionable footwear. I mean, you could eat the boot. You'll still be starving, though. But your tummy will feel full, at least. Fishing is all about the bait. You love baiting, bro? I know about you. Sit out here and bait all day, right? Right? Fisherman Terry sends out two lure. I think we're going to be finding a lot of water types around here, so I should probably switch Decker out of the front. But for now, I'll roll the dice with a Rock Blast. Yeah. Get him. Get him, kid. Oh, come on. I want, I want five hits. Five hits! Make it happen! I mean, we only need three now, but if you want to aim for five, that's, that's even better, right? Hit two times. Oh, God. Here comes the rain dance. Um, this is not good. I'm scared of the rain. And, yeah, my health is already half, so I'm gonna switch out of here. Douglas, he a good boy. He gonna resist all this shit. And, uh, I'll probably need to dole out some potions pretty shortly here. Which isn't so bad. I got a lot of potions. I've been stacking that money up. When I first, uh, started this game, I, I felt a little bit poor, but now we're getting richer and richer as we continue further and further, which is, I suppose, how it's supposed to go. So, he used Flatter, special attack is raised. That kind of sucks, because Douglas doesn't have any special attacks. So now he's just confused. I'm gonna hit himself in the face. That's fine. I'll wait for the fucking confusion to break. It can't last forever. He keeps using Scary Face, which I'm pretty sure uh, this is a slower Mon anyways. So, yeah. Scary face me all you like, as long as you don't got Ice Beam or some shit in the wings. We'll be just fine. But yeah, hit myself in the face for a second time. Oh god, Endeavor. Oh, that's terrible. Please don't hit self. God damn it. What is life anymore? I'm gonna heal. I'm going to heal. I don't give a shit. Endeavor basically brings your Pokemon down to their level of HP, so he's going to do it again. That is absolutely a waste of a potion. <laughs> uh, snapped out of confusion. There we go. Hopefully I can horn leech this life back. I won't have to use another potion. But you never can tell. Jesus. That Pokemon is uh, scarier than I first anticipated. I beat the shit out of so many that I was like, yeah, it's no problem. And then he comes out with, with that kind of stuff? Dang. Condoom. Is this water... water poison? I kinda want a magnitude, but I'll stick with Horn Leech. Uses Barrage, which is not gonna do anything, even if it hits five times. We're fine. I think it's a Grass-type move. Why'd you use a Grass-type move on a Grass-type, bro? Are you even paying attention? I hope he doesn't have any poison moves. Oh, seems we got the speed tie, because I went first that time around, so yeah. Oh, damn it! I thought I was going to KO with the Horn Leech. That's alright, he'll KO himself with Takedown. There you go. See you in hell! Thanks so much! Maybe I need to change my bait. Nah, nah, just keep baiting, dude. You can bait all day. Let's get fucking Decker out of here for a minute. Um, yeah, Douglas can go in the front. He's my boy. The better the bait, the bigger the catch. Yeah, this way you gotta like uh, bait for at least thirty minutes before you before you let her go or something like that. And then it's a really good one, right? What's over here? 
What's up with you? My brother said he really likes shorts, but I never understood their appeal. Jeans are so much better in every way. Fucking heretic. Get out of here. TM11, Sunny Day. Oh, we found Sunny Day on the beach! I guess that makes sense. I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. Jeans are cool, though. Back when I was in the US, always jeans. Now that I'm in the Philippines, always shorts. <laughs> An old rod is outdated, wouldn't you agree? You need a better rod with stronger bait in order to reel in the big fish. Here's a good rod. Why, thank you, sir. Always reply to bait, even with str with even stronger bait. It's the key to success in fishing and shit posting. <laughs> ah, you mean bait like bait? I was thinking bait like bait. B a t e versus b a i t. I'm a spelling whiz. Got it. I sure can, girl. I'm always with you. I feel so reassured. Thank you so much for reassuring me in such a such a manner. This fucking dock is going every which way. I guess we gotta we gotta explore this way, and then we gotta explore the other way. That's no problem. Ponchito, that's a a woman with a mustache. Oh, but it uh doesn't have sand stream, so I am gonna actually try and catch this one. Why not? We need to uh bulk out our roster a little bit, eh? Why not? I want to try out some new pokes. I mean, my team is good. I, of course, enjoy every Pokemon that I've caught thus far, but, yeah. Nobody's an installation, okay? Even, uh, even Douglas might get replaced someday. If I decide I don't like him that much, I'm like, alright, see you later. I know all there is to know about you, but really, he's fucking awesome. He's an amazing poke because he has all these draining moves, so he can keep himself fully healed. Drain Punch and Horn Leech? Mmm. Then a little bit of bulk up, some magnitude, nice round move set. I wish I could teach him Earthquake. That would be quite nice. So this thing put itself to sleep, so I think that counts as a status condition. Let's just keep throwing Pokeballs. We get another Pokeball over there. We gonna catch him up real good. Come on with me. Come along. Very nice. Very nice. Huzzah! And I love that you get fucking EXP for catching stuff. That's pretty interesting. Alright. Look at all those stats. Oh, this is the Evolve form. I thought, uh... Yeah, it's one stage, because I've never seen the younger one. But it's War Warasito and then Ponchito. And then Despacito. No, that's... I made up the third one. If it ever loses its poncho, it will use whatever is near as a cover until another is found. And I will give a nickname. It's a female, so I'm going to name it Consuela. Because, you know, family guy or something. No, no. We need more lemon pledge. Consuela. All right. There you go. Excellent. Wonderfully done. Now, I caught something in front of your house, so you better have something good for me, too. Hi, your Pokemon look tired. Let me inject some help into them for just 500 Poke. Okay. Sounds good. It's better than flying. Oh, I can't fly anymore. Ha! <laughs> That's right. Thanks! Never get scared by a dirty needle. They work wonders. That's called recycling. Alright, so double battle over here, I do think. Let's get Phil and Keck in the front, because I think that'll be a nice combo. Combo wombo. Hey, what up? What up, kids? Don't underestimate us! We mugged a neckbeard and left him for dead in a troll hole. Did you pay the troll toll? <laughs> did you did you fight the day, man? I don't I don't know what I'm talking about. Lolo and Kiki! What up, kids? Got a gut supply and a birdhouse out here. I'm a little bit scared to leave Keck out here, um lest any of these things know some flying type attacks. But I guess it's okay. We'll thunder punch the birdhouse. First of all, and then I will, uh, mm, I guess Faith Attack. We'll get rid of that birdhouse first. If we can take out two of their Pokemon, I think they have four. So we'll take out the birdhouse, she'll send out something else. Oh, they're both weak to flying. Shit. This is not good. This is not good. I didn't think this one out completely. The birdhouse has almost gone down. Oh, and it's paralyzed. Excellent. Because that thing is fast as hell. 
fast as hell. So I'm gonna use Fate Detect on the Birdhouse with Keck next turn, and that should take it down. And then um, I guess we'll go Ice Punch on the Gutsy Fly. Yes, that will work nicely. Hmm. There you go. Take them all out. I don't think the Gutsy Fly knows any flying moves. Because he's one of them shitty bug types, you know? They never learn nothing good. Oh my god. Rico Suave. What the fuck is that? It's disgusting. <laughs> it doesn't look Rico Suave at all. Alright. Ice Punch for the Gutsy Fly. Right in his stupid head. Doesn't quite kill him, though. Well, give him another Ice Punch. I guess x Scissor on Rico Suave? I don't know what this typing is. I couldn't even begin to guess. Electric? Is it kind of like an Ampharos or something? Guts of Fly use Bug Bite. Not very effective. Doesn't matter, because it's dead anyways. But yeah, what kind of moose does this uh, little ram have to use against me? That should unveil at least a little bit of the mystery. Eh? Alright, next Pokemon up is Peacotton. Oh god. Rico Suave used Mirror Coat. What the fuck? And it's got Speed Boost as well. Jeez, this is not good. Alright, I'm gonna make a couple of switches this turn. Let's get Douglas out here. And... Dang, who else? I guess Decker. Decker could iron head the shit out of that peacock. But yeah, um, one of my Pokemon has a fighting type, one has a dark type. So any fairy type moves are really gonna fuck my shit up. Light screen, that's no problem. Oh, and that thing has counter. I'm going to need to be careful. So let's bulk up with uh, Douglas and we'll iron head that peacotton. Use body slam this turn, no problem. I'm resistant to this. I've seen this before. Yes. No problem. Alright. Defense and attack is up. Hopefully we'll slam this thing in the face. Oh, because it's electric and fairy. So it just kind of hits neutrally. Man. Let me tell you something about that man. Well, let's, uh... Should we magnitude? I think magnitude's gonna hurt everybody. So let's not do that. <laughs> I'll use Horn Leech and Iron Head on the Peacotton, just to make sure that it goes down this turn. Maybe uh, Douglas will be able to KO it. Yeah, he's got that bulk up behind him. Super. So is Phil gonna redirect his aim now? I'm not sure. Well, it doesn't really matter. I was really scared of that thing using Counter. But yeah, Iron Head, boop. Smart boy, Decker. That's what I'm talking about. This dude's still speed boosting, which is interesting. I don't really get it, but that's fine. Oh, here comes the reversal. Damn, fighting type move. Four times super effective. That's painful. That is some painful shit that's going on right there. But that's okay. We shall persevere. We shall overcome. Pharaoh, let my people go. I guess your wallet is safe. Yes, my Pokemons keep it safe. I actually keep it in my anal geese butt. <laughs> now get out of here before we change our minds. Damn, some tough little girls. Look the fucking mean streets of, of Fochin. Fochin! Alright, got a couple Pokemon uh, a little beat up from that battle. Oh, now we're out on Route 12. Does this lead to a, a town or something? Am I just going to be running around forever? Nobody knows! A wiki berry? What is that? I ain't never heard of that before! Gotta have a look. Open... Wiki berry. Restores HP but may cause confusion when used. Interesting. I think it is a custom berry just for this game. Hmm. Now just stand still there. Oh, let's fight this picnicker. I don't need no confusion about that. Oh, it's fucking Sniper. It ain't a picnic at all. It's got Tank Cube. I think this is like the final form of Glass Hannon, isn't it? We'll find out. Sky Uppercut. Yah! Fucking trick. Super effective, but yeah. 
it hardly did anything, which is terrifying. So this is not a glass cannon at all. I think it's still in the same evolutionary line, though. Maybe they just switched the stats around for funsies. But yeah, that that thing is taking a beating. Takes a licking, keeps on ticking. I don't really want to uh, try X's or whatever. You might have a steel type too. No, that doesn't make sense. If it was four times super effective, I'd be fucking knocking this thing out the box. I think it's just ice. But I ain't too sure. I also could switch to Mysterio and try like flamethrower on it. Oh no! Sheer cold. He locked on and then he used a one hit KO move. God damn. That's terrible. Well, I guess uh now's the time, Mysterio. Get in there. Make us proud. Fucking terrifying thing. Lock on and one hit KO moves. Can't do that in competitive, but in this game, fucking anything goes. Anything goes. Almost leveled up Mysterio again. Like I said, he my favorite boy. And there's Glass Sandin. Kind of the opposite. You know what? I bet it's a like uh, a split evolutionary line. If attack is higher than defense, it becomes this thing. If defense is higher than attack, it becomes that other thing. But he comes at me with the ice beam. I think I'm going to be okay. Got a pretty high special defense. Well, not quite okay, but I did live. <laughs> I guess I'll take it. And yeah, flamethrower wipes that thing off the map. Because it has no defense. It's all attack. Alright, so Mysterio is our biggest boy now, at level 45, and he wants to learn Flatter. No, that's not gonna happen. I don't... I don't play with those, uh, boost their attacks and give them confusion moves. What the fuck for? Pigason. Mmm. I think it's fighting type. I think I thought that before. Was I right? I was right. Yeah, I got it. Ha <laughs> ha. He uses Bulk Up. That's just a mistake. Unless he got the Sucker Punch, which uh, I don't think he does, because he's big and fat. Oh, he's also holding on to Leftovers. Zine! Where'd you get them from? Can I have some? <laughs> I want some of your Leftovers. Wrap them up in foil. We good. Cause he good. Alright. So, uh, yeah, explored a couple new routes today. Beat the shit out of a bunch of people. Boom! Headshot! Everyone runs faster with a knife. Maybe I could teach you how to do a 360 no-scope. Maybe. Probably not, though. Anyways, friends, this has been Pokemon Clover. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. If you did enjoy the episode, please don't forget to like, comment, and to subscribe. That is always, always appreciated. We've got links down in the description as well for Patreon, Discord, Twitter, whatever you'd like to join me on. Uh, yeah, come and support me. Say hello. I'll say hello back. We can be best friends. Uh, or at least good friends. You know. <laughs> As close as we could be through the internet. Anyways, friends, once again, this has been Pokemon Clover. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I hope to see you in the next one. And until then, friends, bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.